Hello my friends and welcome to another bikini review and for today's bikini review I am going to show you light in the box bikini. So for today's video, my friends, I am going to do another bikini review. It was a while since I did a dedicated bikini review. I've been doing some like Amazon mixed with some bikinis in, but it was a while since I did a dedicated bikini review. So that is what I'm going to do today. And for today's bikini review, it's all from Light in the Box and I have six different bikinis. So I just want to say like before I start this review, I know I have a mixed audience here and I just wanted to say like Light in the Box have a lot and they have both female and male clothes so if you are male and you are watching this video you can go and check it out because they have a lot of things also for male and like they have clothes and things so they have a mixture of everything so it's not only for like bikinis but now I think we're gonna dig into it otherwise this video is going to be too long so for the bikinis that I have I have some that is more plain and some that is very boom in your face so we are going to take a look on the first bikini that I am going to show you so this bikini is very much a bling type of bikini. All of these bikinis are super affordable, so that is a huge plus because they are just very affordable and it depends on where you are living because they are adding on taxes and everything. So to get the specific price to your country, click on the links down below and you will see the price, but all of them are very affordable. So this first bikini is a very blingy type of bikini. So as you can see, it's a triangle bikini and then you have this extra effects that you're tying like underneath. This one is not so much stretch. It's a little bit of stretch and I'm wearing this in extra large if I don't misremember. Yeah, extra large and I will say it runs a hint bit small. I mean, I will say that all of these bikinis are very comparable to the AliExpress bikinis that I've been reviewing before. So if we say compared to those sizes, they are the same kind of size range but if we say like compared to normal sizes I will say that all of them runs a hint bit small than the size. So this is extra large and I will say that it runs more like a medium large. I have pretty big chest area so they are covering enough but it's like it, it's 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 on the bare minimum uh, but it's a gorgeous one it is a little bit of itchy mostly in the underpants like a little bit of itch from this fabric but i mean this is this type of bikini that you're wearing to look gorgeous not that it's going to be the most comfortable <laughs> at least that is my thoughts on it you have some stretch in the bands are stretchy it's very important that the bands are stretchy and you have a little bit of stretch here as well a gorgeous bikini for if you have like a event that you want to wear a spectacular bikini this one is really spectacular and I have some more of the spectacular bikini range I will say this one is a red bikini. I also have this in size extra large and I will say this runs a little bit smaller in the size also as you can see in the cups like this is not extra large cups. Comes with silver details. These details are gorgeous. Tie it in the back and in the front so it's very flexible and the same thing on the pants here. You can tie it on the sides and I will say the pants run a little bit more I will not say true to size but the pants are more like a normal size large and I will say that the the bikini top is more like a size medium large and you can tie it in, in the sides and you have the silver details here we can get focus yeah so I will say like this is a very nice bikini and it's with silver details usually I go for um, gold details and then on the more spectacular last one that I have I then I have three that is more simple is this one <laughs> So this is also a size extra large and the thing is with this like I will say this bikini the top runs like a size large I will say like this one is a little bit bigger than the other two in the cup size it's not making it just this is more very bright orange my lights is flashing out some of the colors uh, so you tie it in the back and in the top area and you have this spectacular details and in the bottom part I will say 
the bottom part is a little bit bigger so as you will see in the try on these are not only in the front on me they are actually going a little bit around my hips so the knots are like more not so much in the front it's more a little bit further back i will say like this fits a normal size large even a medium so here are the three more spectacular blingy type of bikinis that are maybe not suitable for normal pool hang they are a little bit more for spectacular events but i really like them because i like those type of bikinis also to mix it up a little bit but of course i am going to talk a little bit about bikinis that are more convenient to use when you are using them for like more on the beach more suitable for the beach so first we have this bikini as you can see this one is you have a higher raised part that you can like move up or down how much you want i'm going to show you in the try on and then you have the side bands and this is a little higher raised and it comes with this gorgeous bikini top that is like this i have this in size large i think i don't have the tags left in the yeah no size extra large size extra large and i will say it is more like a size large but they are very stretchy and flexible, so you can stretch them out a lot, but I will say more like a size large. Gorgeous bikini, comes with the clippers in the back, and I will say the clippers are a tiny bit big on me. As you will see in the try-on, it's not super tight around, but I can, of course, tie it instead if I don't want to use the clippers. So I really like that bikini, and this is more like a normal suitable bikini for the beach. Then I have this bikini, so it's like a banjo. I love the color selection on this one. So it is a banjo with a halter neck and then you tie it in the back. And I really like this type of bikinis that you can tie in the back because then I don't have the problem that I need to size up to make them cover my cups. I can always make them fit around also. I have this in size large and it is more on the smaller side, I will say. As you can see, it is not so wide. So for me, it is covering but it's barely covering i would have been better off with a size extra large in this top for sure and this bands you can take off if you don't want them you can take them off and then it's completely banjo so you can decide for yourself and the pants to them are this high raise ones and i will say like these are also tiny bit small in the size i will say more like a size medium large uh, maybe not true medium but a little bigger medium and high raise and it's hard to see the colors i'm gonna take down the light a little bit now you can see the colors a little bit better but i like the color selection a lot and the last bikini i actually have in size medium and i will say this is the bikini out of the batch that is the most true to size <laughs> So this is more like a crop top type of bikini. So as you can see, it is a crop top like this. And then you have some details here on the front. And here you can adjust how open you want it. If you want it more open, oh, you're gonna see it better when I'm wearing it. Or if you want it more closed. And it's coming with kind of normal, a little bit high waist. But what I like with this is that you can adjust them on the side. And that is why I went for size medium. So you can adjust them in the side like this. So if you want them tighter or a little bit more loose because I hate when it's digging in too much in the panties. So this is all the bikinis that I have for today's review and we are going to take a look how they are looking on on a little lookbook and then we're going to get back in here.
yeah, that was the bikinis for today's video. And I am so like, you can find so good bikinis and quality ones on AliExpress and Light in the Box. So I am very happy that I tried. This is the first time I'm trying bikinis from Light in the Box. I will say overall quality compared to the prices, awesome. Like it's really good quality when it comes to this much affordable kind of bikinis. Um, my favorite, because I know you're going to ask, I honestly do not know because I picked bikinis that are super different from one another. So it's so hard to pick a favorite. I love bandeau bikinis. I love this type of more covering up. I love like, I mean, I love all of them. The blingy ones are maybe not so suitable in the beach, but otherwise I really like all of the bikinis. And what goes for overall sizing, I will say my overall experience is that sizing is one size small in all the sizes. So if you are in between two sizes, definitely go for the upper size. I am in normal clothes in between size small and medium, but in bikinis, I am usually in between medium and large. And I took extra large in some of these bikinis because they are triangle and I need to make them cover. So I think that you are better off taking a size that is a little bit bigger because all of these are adjustable. So you can adjust them if they are too big. So that is my experience. Of course, you have the links to all of them in the description box down below. Make sure to check that out. And they always have some offers and things on light in the box. So if I find you some offers, I will throw them in the description box down below also because they used, used to have like coupons and things so you can save yourself some money so i will throw everything about that in the description box down below i will also maybe throw in some links that you can see like other things if you are not interested in buying bikinis but if you want to see what else they have so that being said my friends thank you so much for watching this time you know the drill give it a thumbs up click on the subscribe check out my instagram and let's be friends there as well and i hope i'm going to see you in my coming videos but until then take care